Here's how you would go about sharing videos from YouTube on your Google Drive. In other words, if you'd like to make some videos available for your students that you didn't necessarily create but you think would be beneficial for them to watch. So I'm in my Google Drive and right now I'm in my English class and over here you can see I have class 1 and class 2. So in this particular case, let's say I want to provide my students with some videos that they should watch in class 2. So I'm going to double click and now I'm inside the class 2 folder. Next, I'm going to click on New, and I'm actually going to choose a Google Slide, and I'll show you why in a moment. It's going to ask me, is it okay to share it in here? It's going to be publicly available. I'm going to say, yeah, that's okay. We're now in something that looks somewhat like a PowerPoint presentation, but we're not going to be necessarily creating a PowerPoint. What we want to do is choose a theme. I'm going to choose something white, and I'm going to click on OK. And here is the first slide of my presentation. Now this is where it gets a little bit different from PowerPoint. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go over to YouTube. And let's say over here this video, Montreal in two minutes. I really like that. I want my students to watch that for class two. I'm going to take down the address over here, right click and copy. I'm now going to go back inside the presentation. I'm going to choose insert and I'm going to choose video. Next, it's going to ask me, do I want to search for the video or do I have the URL, the address? Well, I already have the address, so I'm going to click on URL. I'm going to right click over here and choose paste. Yep, that's the video, and I click on select. If you'd like, you can repeat the process and insert additional videos by clicking on the little plus over here, creating a new slide, and inserting more videos. Don't worry about this text, it won't show up. So I'm going to right click and I'm going to delete this. We're good for now. There's two more steps. What I want to do is I want to give it a name so that my students know exactly what they're looking at. So I'm going to click here and I'm going to call this YouTube videos for class 2. I'm going to click on OK and if I actually want to go see what this looks like I can click on the little folder. It says this item is in class 2. I can click on class 2 and that will bring me back to my Google Drive and you should see in class 2 there you go my presentation students can click on that and watch the videos